Hello, Diana. You have another question for me. About your movie, the role in Home, Homebound? Homebound, yes. Well, if, if you, those, those people that have seen the film, one thing, another, another thing that they'll notice that is very consistent with one of my, one of my more passionate uh, ventures is the military and Latinos in the military. When I spoke with Fanny, we both, she was very willing to let me make a choice about something, and that was to make uh, the character a Vietnam veteran. And so, uh, one of the producer's uncles had been in the in the army in Vietnam, and he had a vest, a uh, jeans vest, with a lot of memorabilia from the military and so we used that we never said that he was a veteran we never said you know what he did in the war whatever but the veteran latino veteran was represented by that do you have any family members that are in war or in military you know, soldiers or, or any? oh yeah i don't know that any latino families aren't you know ha don't have anything and another and one of the main reasons that i do projects like that is because I was in I I was around in college during the Vietnam era. My brother was two years older than I was, and he enlisted in the military. He served during the Vietnam era, but in the Air Force, and he was stationed here in California. So we were grateful about that, and so because he was in the military, even though I no longer had a student deferment, and my lottery number was 41. I should have been gone, but I wasn't because he was in the military. And so a lot of the work that I do, I do it because of my appreciation for what my brother and a lot of other guys did that I didn't have to do. And so to pay tribute to them, when you play this, those roles, I, ha I like to represent them. And also when I write stuff, I also make sure I write that into whatever I'm writing. Okay, gracias, Don Ernesto. Muchas gracias. Okay.